I have three riddles with one answer. Three riddles with one answer. Number one, what tastes better than it smells? One. The next one, what is always wet but not rusty? Question three, it is long, pink and wet and it is very bad to pull it out in front of people. What is it? Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ba -ba -ba! Tongue! Yes, to those of you that say tongue, you're very, very correct. And to those of you that are still thinking, now you know the answer. It is tongue. Welcome to Tony Clown Sunday School Class. Today is going to be a very exciting edition. Because today, we'll be talking about mind your words. Mind your word. But before we say anything further, let us open the scripture. Reading from Ephesians chapter 5, verse 4. Ephesians chapter 5, verse 4. So let's read. Bam, bam, bam. Dirty stories, foul talk, and coarse jokes. These are not for you. Instead, remind each other of God's goodness and be thankful. So, it's time for today's illustration. And for the illustration, I will be using a tube of toothpaste. And this is what I want to do. Just watch. After the whole illustration, I will explain what I want you to know. Now, um, you're going to help me. I will squeeze out every bit of paste in this. Uh, before you say five so you're going to count like one two three four five but before you get to five I've removed everything are you ready are you ready go count 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 yes done boom come on come on come on yes everything is here before you say five yeah, I was able to put everything out, remove everything out of the paste. So now, the task for me is this. Before you count five, I should be able to return all this paste here back into this tube. It's not possible. Wait, wait, wait. Let me try it. Okay, so count. Go! One, two, three. <laughs> it's not going in it's not going in this is exactly how our words are when you speak when you say something whatever you say cannot go back into your mouth like it can return everything you say all the words you say if you if you are the one that always say the bad thing you always abuse people you always say bad jokes it will be very difficult to take it back just as it is difficult for me to put this paste back into the tube you see it was very easy say bringing it out just as easy as, as it is for you to just speak for you to abuse someone for you to talk bad at someone just as easy as it is for you that is how easy it is for me to bring the paste out of the tube but when it's time for me to get it back it becomes something that is impossible so it is impossible to put back all those words that you said. So since you will not be able to take back your words, why don't you just say the right thing? Yes. Why don't you just think before you talk? Oh, that's another one. And I will help you know how to think before you talk. So, here are the five questions you need to ask yourself before speaking. Five questions you need to ask yourself before speaking. To make it easy for you, 
I'm going to give those words the acronyms THINK. The acronyms THINK. THINK. So the T there stands for truth. That is this word truthful? What, am I, what I am about to say. Is it the truth? Is it truthful? That is the first thing you should ask yourself. If it is truthful. And the second one, H. And that will be helpful. That is that word helpful. This word that I'm about to speak. This thing I'm about to say. Is it helpful? And the third one is I. Is that word inspiring? If the word is not inspiring, throw the key away. Zip your mouth like zip. Throw the key away. And the fourth one, which is N. You ask yourself, this thing I'm about to say, is it necessary? Is it necessary? Should I say it? Is it important that I say it? It is not important. Throw the key away. Don't say it. And the last one, which is K. You ask yourself, is this word kind? If I say this thing, am I being kind to the person I'm saying it to? You need to ask yourself these five questions before you say anything. Do you know why? Because whatever you say, whatever you say, you cannot take it back. Just as I cannot put back those words, those paste, the paste into the tube. That is just the same way you cannot take your words back. And since you can't take your words back, the best thing is to say the right thing at all time. And to say the right thing at all time, you need to think. Think. T-H-I-N-K. Truth. Is it truthful? The next one. Is it what? Good, helpful. And the I... Inspiring N is what? Necessary and K kind. And thank you for watching today's episode of Tony Cloud Sunday School Class. But before we go, it's time for the song of the day. Oh, be careful, little mouth, what you say. Oh, be careful, little mouth, what you say. For the father of the club is looking down in love Oh, be careful little mouth what to say <laughs> Alright, you're going to do it with me now, huh? It's very simple Okay Oh, be careful little mouth what to say <laughs> Oh, be careful little mouth what to say <laughs> For the father of the club is looking down in love Oh, be careful little mouth what to say <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the song of today. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for always watching at all time. And for those of you watching for the first time, remember to press the sus subscribe. That red one, subscribe. Boom, boom, boom. Press it, yes. Then press the bell so that you always know if Tony Clown is putting up another new Sunday school class. Ah. Uh, lesson and one more thing remember to tell your friends to watch Sunday School Class with Tony Clown remember and thank you very much thanks mommy thanks daddy for letting your children watch it okay this is where we say bye bye are you ready are you ready okay let's do it together say bye 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 bye, bye.